What's up guys, it's Tom here, and um, we're back with the server for part 2. Um, this is going to be the port forwarding, which uh, lets your friends come on and play in your server. Um, but I want to say thank you guys and girls for 1000 subs. I never thought I'd get that far, but yeah, thanks to you guys. And uh, I'll have a special video on the video responses that you can click on, and uh, I'll be uploading that later. So you can check that out. Um, I'll just give you a hint, it's a giveaway. So yeah, um, but yeah, now we're going to do the port forwarding. So we're going to start off by going down to the Windows icon, and there you want to type in CMD, you should get a cmd.exe, that's, that's your command prompt window, and you'll see this little flash little uh, line, and you want to type in ipconfig, so it's ipconfig, press enter, and you'll get a, a window with all these uh, IP feed for address, a load of numbers and uh, words. And what we're interested in is your IPv4 address, and uh, I'll tell you a bit more about your default gateway. So you want to open up a new, uh, just open up a Internet Explorer, or whatever internet you're using. And if you're on Google, you just want to clear the top bar. And once you're there, what you want to do is you want to get your default gateway in the command prompt. It'll, it'll say default gateway. Usually it is 192.168.1.1. I think that's everyone. I'm not positive about that. But just whatever one you're is and type it in the URL that you just opened. So mine is 192.168.1.1. And press enter. And this is uh, this is practically your router um, website that you're going to be logging into. This is your router. You need to know your username. You can usually put a blank username, but I think it is uh, admin you can put. And your password, you probably haven't never seen this, so it's going to be uh, admin also. So it's A-D-M-I-N. That's your password and your username. Um, for Netgear, it could be different. It could be uh, password is in the password. I'm not sure. You can look it up at Google. But yeah, uh, this is the one. Um, this is for Linksys. And you just want to press OK, and it'll bring you on to uh, the Linksys router, which this is your router you got from your internet supplier. So basically, you want to go over to your applications of gaming. If you have something similar to that on a different router, um, then uh, you can do that. And uh, in here, you'll see an application. This is what you want to call. Uh, you can call it anything. I called it Minecraft. You can call it a server. Um, depends on what you want to call it. Uh, it doesn't really matter. All right, and here we go. This is the port. If you want to put in star, if you want to put 25565, just type that in. And then what you also want to do is type in to end. So start to end, you want to put it to 25565. Don't worry about the top line, guys. Don't worry about that. That's just different. Minecraft, then you want to put 25565 to 25565. The protocol, you want to put it to both. Make sure it's on both. And your IP address, this is what you want to do. You'll see 192.168.1. Then you've got a uh, blank box which you can put in. And you want to delete that. And you want to go back into your command prompt. And you'll see an IP v4 address. What you want to do is go, it'll say 192.168.1. It could be Anthem 102, 100. It could be 98 for I don't know. So you'll see whatever it is and you can put it as it. So you can put 101 minus. So you go down and you type in 101 into that box. And when you have that done, you want to type, click the little box with a tick. And then what you want to do is go save settings. And once that's it'll come up, settings are successful. Now that is your port that's going to be uh, working so people will join. But now they need to know your actual I external IP. So the way you do this, I'm not going to show you, but I'll put a link in the description. You want to type in on Google or wherever you want to type it. You can type in uh, IP chicken, IP uh, chicken. What's my IP address? I'll put that link in uh, the description, and uh, you can go take a look at your IP. And it could be, and it could be like eight eight point nine six point seven eight point eight eight could be like that and all all you have to do is copy that and put two f then you send it to your friends and put double dot two five five six five so I'll do it here uh, in a notepad for instance so uh, I'm just gonna make up a random IP and uh, you can do it so I'm gonna open up my notepad so it could be uh, the port that you set uh, so this could be your IP eight six point uh, nine eight seven point nine six dot one two three it could be anything um, then this will be your IP that will come up 
what you want to add on to that is double the two dots, press shift and then find the two dots on your keyboard, type in 25565, that is the port that we just done, forwarded, and all you should do is send that IP with the port, so you're going to add that on, this bit onto your, onto your IP that you just got off IP chicken, and uh, you can send that to your friends and they should be able to connect to your server, so guys, yeah. Uh, I hope this helped. If it did, leave a like and I will see you in the next video and this will be a special video. So, peace.